Today, Kevin and I have two items to try from Molly's Bakehouse. I had never seen these before. Mm -hmm. I heard of Molly's Bakehouse. They're actually uh, out of uh, Brooklyn, New York. It's www.mollysbakehouse.com. I found these in the Fresh Market. They were $9.99 a piece. We have the cupcakes. And then I have jelly donuts. And these were the only things, like these were when we w went in the door of the Fresh Market. And I told Kevin, I said, well, when we get back to the bakery area, we'll look to see if they have anything else um, from Molly's Bakehouse. And because I thought, well, we'll get more things to try. They didn't have anything else. They had these at the front door when you walked in and that was it. It says, Molly never wandered far from her grandmother's apron strings, born into a family of European artists and bakers. She was destined to dust up some flour and wet up some tasty pastries. Today, her bakehouse pays homage to her grandmother and namesake as she brings naturally crafted goodness to uh, goodness to families everywhere. Uh, so this, uh, there's 12 cupcakes in here. Uh, sorry, there's 10 cupcakes. No, there's 12. It says 10 servings. 10, but it's probably not a full cup. Okay, because I was gonna say, I can count. There's 12 <laughs> cupcakes in here. It says 10 servings, one ounce, 28 grams is 110 calories. So by weight. So we're by weight. So who knows how much it is per cupcake, uh, but I can hear these sprinkles. Oh, there, there's a lot of sprinkles. That is some sprinkles. <laughs> okay, here we go. And they're all like vanilla cupcakes. I mean, they're actually covered with sprinkles. Yes, they did not skimp at all. And it is, it's just a solid okay. vanilla cupcake. Mm -hmm. Do you get the dye from the mm -hmm. blue? No, no, it's really good. Good. I mean, there might be something there, but I think it's just the cupcake, honestly. Mm -hmm. It has so many sprinkles that it adds like a solid layer of a crunch to the top. Mm -hmm. Not like crunchy crunch, but just a, a firmer texture. Yes, sure. it's a firmer texture. They're and not what I'd call overly sweet cupcakes. No, but it's just, honestly, this tastes like a, a, a I, I hate, to, it would probably insult them, but that vanilla tastes like a vanilla box mix that I, mm -hmm. I could make at home. I yeah. mean, it's good. There's nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with it at all. Um, but yeah, it just doesn't taste that different from what I yeah, can make. Yeah, because the frosting is really not super sweet or, no. or super vanilla or anything like that. I mean, it's not, it's, it's, it's not bad at all. Like I said, it's just not anything like spectacular. It's just a normal vanilla cupcake. Um, what does it say about calories on these? Um, this one says one donut is 240. Okay. Does it say what kind of jelly? It looks like strawberry. Oh, that's too small for me to read. I can't, I can't see it, it's too small. You want that piece? <laughs> I'm sure. Okay. Yeah, it says the same in front about the, the apron strings and yes. all that stuff. Yes, okay. Oh. 240 for... Yeah, 240 for one. It kind of tastes like a raspberry almost though, doesn't it? But it looks, I agree, it looks like strawberry. I'm gonna be honest, it's not strong enough of anything for me to figure out. No, I had to take a really big bite of almost all jelly to taste anything. I like it. I like the jelly in the middle. It is sweet. I'm not seeing any, I'm not seeing the word strawberry. I'm not seeing, I'm not seeing any Berry, flavor anything? of bear. No, I'm literally not seeing any flavor of berry at all. 
corn syrup, I mean, and vanilla flavor. It, it, it doesn't necessarily taste like any uh, particular berry. It's just berry. It's just berry. It is a berry. It, it, it might be a mixture of strawberry and raspberry, but nothing stands out. I do like that flavor, though. Yeah, it's good. Um, I don't think these are any better. I don't than, either. Than a ton of other jelly donuts. I mean, I hate to say this. This is going to sound awful. You can go to Kroger and Walmart. I said that. I said this tastes like it was exactly out of the box. Like, you yeah. can go to Kroger and Walmart and get their brand of jelly donuts, and it would taste just as good. As that. And maybe, maybe if you've, uh, maybe they have a storefront, and if you've been there, uh, maybe you're like, oh my gosh, I can't believe they're saying that. But you have to take in consideration that these are probably being shipped to the store frozen. Maybe. And, and, yeah, and, or at least cold. And they're laying them out. And so by the time we're getting them, who knows how long. The date was fine. I'm not saying that. But who knows how long before they've been made before we're getting to try them. And so they just, it's not going to have the same bang as it does if you were to go in their storefront. Mm -hmm. For us, these do not taste like. They're just okay. They're okay. Yeah, they don't taste like anything spectacular. Yeah, they're absolutely they're nothing okay. wrong with them. No, not at all. But you're paying ten dollars for these. Oh yeah, I forgot that. Yeah. Yeah, I forgot. You're paying that. ten dollars wow. for four donuts. They're definitely not worth that. No, I think you can get a jelly donut at Walmart or Kroger for like a dollar fifty. Yeah, ten dollars for four donuts is a lot. Yeah, that's yeah. two fifty a piece. I didn't think about it. Yeah, yeah. when you take it that don't, consideration. Just the yeah, well, the cupcakes were ten as well. I know, but I'm, I'm saying they're, these are two fifty a piece. Yeah. So you have to develop, well, there's it's basically a dollar, a little less than a dollar a piece for a cupcake. It just that's, uh, this is no no, worth it's it. absolutely not worth it. Not worth that. I hate to say all. that, but it's, yeah, when you take in consideration the price, so even though the flavor, there's nothing wrong with the flavor, it's just not at ten dollars. Mm -hmm. So hopefully, we'll save some of you if you go to the fresh market and see these. Unless you just don't mind paying ten dollars for a vanilla cupcake, but it's nothing any different than you're going to get at Walmart for a vanilla cupcake. Actually, not as sweet as what no, you get at Walmart. No, unless you just don't care, then you know, then buy them. But uh, I would not get them again. I wouldn't either, no, yeah. especially for that price. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.